Hello. Today is December the 6th, the National Day of Remembrance and Action on Violence Against Women. 22 years ago, today, in Montreal, 14 young women were murdered, and we will always remember them. And our union will continue to take action in the struggle to end violence against women. This year, 19,000 women and children across Ontario sought safety in shelters. The only good news to be drawn from this fact is that the shelters exist to provide them sanctuary, and they did not always do so. ETT and ETFO support many of these shelters financially. One small thing we will do this year is send out electronic seasonal greeting cards and contribute the money saved to organizations like the Native Women's Resource Center. December the 9th, this week, at the Direct Energy Center at the CNE is Federation Day, the first time we've held this event for a couple of years. Lieutenant General Romeo Dallaire is our keynote speaker, along with Michael Ciccuanini. There will be lots going on on the day, and I'm looking forward to seeing you there. I'm also hoping for Janet Wilson, author of Shannon and the Dream for a School, about the situation in Attawapiskat, to be present at the trade show on Federation Day. The scandalous situation of Attawapiskat and other northern native communities has caught the attention of most Canadians, and not least our students. Today a letter came from Aisha at Regent Park, telling me what she was doing to support the children of Attawapiskat and urging our union to take action. I'm going to arrange for Janet Wilson to dedicate a book to Aisha and her classmates and deliver it to them personally. And I will also look for ways to get these excellent books into as many of our schools as possible. December the 9th is also the last day for the bargaining survey. Please provide input and continue to hold ETT meetings in your schools with your executive officer to discuss the issues. The ETT negotiating team will be meeting with other locals at provincial meetings and we so look forward to sharing information from these meetings with you in the near future. Thank you very much and see you on Friday.